hate this channel. No! No! Lisa, do you think you overdid it with our hair? Uh-uh. Nope. I sure don't. Because we're going to Beverly Hills. Now, if I'm going to do good at that audition, we got to look like stars. Hey, guys. Welcome back to my channel. It's Reese coming back to you with another tutorial. So stay tuned if you want to know how I apply this wig. So you guys, I already mixed the bleach together with 30 volume developer and my generic bleach I got from my local beauty supply store. Um, if you want to know all the products I use in this video today, check my Amazon store out. Link down below. I did leave this on for about 30 minutes and I washed it with purple shampoo and conditioned it with purple conditioner just to take out the brassiness of the bleach. Um, I only washed the frontal part because I am going to dye this wig. So I just washed this wig right now, you guys. Only the frontal part because I am going to pluck this unit. So this is how it looks. And this is how much hair that I lost from this wig when I first got it. So I don't know if this looks like a lot, let me know. I think it looks a little bit normal for me. And I am going to pluck this unit off camera. I do have a in-depth tutorial on how I pluck my unit, so check that out. So you guys, I am going to show you a little trick on how I dyed this wig. I did buy this wig with my own money. I wanted this wig to be black so I did use blue black on this wig I did not have enough so I had to use emerald green this is my little trick with dyeing wigs I put it in sections in ponytails and I think it makes the dyeing process go faster and easier for you guys so that's a little trick that I want to show you um basically yeah, you need two bottles if you're trying to dye any type of wig because it was not enough. So one bottle is never enough, you guys. Always buy two bottles of anything when it comes to hair. <laughs> so I'm just going to show you how I just dye this wig and how I dyed my frontal. So you guys, I haven't been gluing down my wigs lately, so I've been using the elastic band method. So if you don't like using glue, I highly recommend this step. So you guys, I already washed this wig and blow dried it. And now, and I already cut the lace, plucked the hair all that if you guys want to know a very detailed step by step wig application i do have a in-depth wig series and each video shows how i do this process right now this video i'm just showing you my new way of applying wigs without glue um, and how i style them
so you guys i put some foundation on my hands got a beauty blender and i'm actually going to put some makeup on the frontal after i apply it i put some got to be glue blast free spray to hold the makeup and as you can see i have my elastic band on this wig i put it near um at the end of the frontal if that makes sense and now i am going to use the adjustable straps that it came with as well for extra security and then i actually do use the combs on the side and on the back of the wig i did remove the middle one because i just want the wig as flat as possible So I am making sure that I place the wig where I want it to be placed and how I liked it before I straightened it. I did straighten this wig off camera. Um, let me know if you guys want to know a tutorial on how I straighten my wigs. But yeah, I already styled it off camera. Um, I am using my combs for extra security. I am using a two wig caps as well under this wig just so um, it can look seamless. And then I'm just really being careful on how I place my wig before I start to work on the baby hairs. So now I'm going to get a water bottle that it actually came with. I'm so glad it came with these water bottle spray things. Um, so I spray some water on the edges and then using a brush to just style the edges to see how I want them. And I don't know if you guys remember from the beginning, towards the beginning of the video, I already cut these baby hairs while I after I blow dried this wig. So I'm just using my... It's not a toothbrush, but a little wig brush, edge brush I got from the beauty supply store. And I'm just styling my edges with just water. And then we are going to use some got to be glue styling gel. I'm going back to the old school method, y'all, because I don't, I don't have time to be cleaning these wigs like I did in the summertime. So this is just a very fast way to apply these wigs um and then to actually take them off as well instead of sleeping with them every time so i actually like using the rat tail to style my edges and while i'm styling my edges i am putting it on the lace and um the hair so what this does is lay the frontal without me putting like that strip of glue first and then applying it so I'm applying it as I um, lay these baby hairs and so the baby hairs are is what is gonna basically hold down this front part of my lace front <laughs> sorry I don't know if I make sense you guys but visually it makes sense so I'm just gonna stop talking and just style my edges and you guys watch As you can see, I am using the rat tail comb to lay these edges as well as putting glue on the lace and my edges. This, um, not glue, but gel makes the hair look very sleek and shiny like I just got out of the salon with the silk press. So I love this look. I love this gel because all you can do is just put water on it just to take it off and then just to reapply it put more water and then a little bit more gel 
to wet it back or to like you know moisten it up and it will be brand new so this is reusable this look basically is re reusable for about a week and a half so it saves my edges it saves me time applying wigs like sis i don't have any more time to be just you know taking my time gluing this wig all that so yeah i'm just basically touching up this wig using a hot comb to flatten my hair i do use this silky spray um and pomegranate scent it smells amazing and it makes my hair super shiny and glisten so yes yeah, sis i am slayed for the quads and yeah that's basically it you guys don't forget to like comment and subscribe for more videos i love you guys so much i'm actually just super happy that this hair came out the way it did like oh yes duh. all right i'm done <laughs> bye you guys i love you so much i'll see you in my next video Mwah.